Today I will show you how to use Infinite Painter. Open the Infinite Painter. Here you can see three options. Blank Canvas from Image Pattern. Start with Blank Canvas. Here is your canvas size. You can choose any size. I will choose 2000 by 1600 or you can choose from presets. You can choose any color or texture for your canvas. Turn on time lapse if you want to record your drawing process. You can set a video resolution. I will set 1080p. Now click on create. On the left you have your brushes. Try different brushes and see what you like. Make it on the favorite list. It will be easy to find that brush later. For now I will use 6B pencil. If your line looks shaky then go to the particular brush setting and increase smoothness. Then have blending. You can use any brush for blending. Under that you got your eraser. Just like blending you can use any brush for erasing. And here you can increase or decrease size of your brush or eraser or blender. And then you have your color palette. And color picker tool. And here you can change your brush opacity, flow and softness. Now if you want to import reference click on three dots click on import. You can import any image from your gallery or file. Even you can import your downloaded brushes from file. Let me import a image. Now you got to option layer or reference. I will choose reference. You can zoom in zoom out the reference or move it on the screen. Click on this pin icon here. You can hide or delete the reference. You can see your time lapse here. If your recording is on, save to file or delete it if you want. When your drawing will complete export from here. Now click on settings. If you are using a stylus like me then go to the stylus section and disable the finger option and then go to the brush settings turn on draw cursor. Here you can see your layers. Click on plus icon to add a layer. Click on a layer. You got multiple options. Duplicate, march, clip. We will learn those later on the video. Here you have your all create and edit tools. Now let me draw a circle. Draw and hold. It will make a perfect circle. Or you can use shapes to draw a circle. Now I will add a layer under this layer for base color. I'll use fill tool to fill color. Now I'll add a layer top of this layer for shading. As you can see, shading spread out of the circle, but I want to add shading in the circle, so I will clip this layer. Now see, that's how you can use clip masking. If you want to clear a layer then click on that layer now clear or delete that layer. Now let me show you a quick demonstration. I will draw this skull. I am using 6B pencil. Now I will transform this sketch little bit on the left, so I will use basic transform tool. The forehead look little bigger, let me correct this using lasso selection. There are lots of tools in infinite painter. And learning all the tools in just one video, that's impossible. So Infinite Painter Tutorial Part 2 will come. Let me know in the comments if you want to see Part 2. Until then practice what you are learned, 
explore different brushes and tools. If you like this video, you can watch my Infinite Painter Tips playlist. Finally, the drawing is complete. Now I will export it. There are lots of options I'll export in PNG.